now we're ready to, after we've learned our subdivisions in quarters and halves for the rolling, now we want to sort of uh, dissect what's going on with the upper body, really moving as a byproduct of the heel lift. So the ultimate result will look like the reciprocal front body sternum spirals um, that I titled washing the floor. So this has the same sort of effect, um, just understanding that we never push off with the hand to initiate a roll, to initiate a spiral. It's the lifting of the heel that pulls the hand in as a byproduct. And then as the heel pushes off, the hand lowers us back again. So let's just start with our, we'll start with our right heel coming up and over as it pulls in the right hand. And we'll let that right hand lower us to pubic bone once again. Left heel lifting up and over, pulling in the left hand, and left hand lowers us to pubic bone. And lifting up and over with that right heel, pulling in the right hand, we lower with right hand to pubic bone. We lift up and over with left heel to pull in left hand, and left hand lowers us to pubic bone once again. This just allows us to make sure that the motion in the arms when coming from prone or on the stomach to supine or on the back allows us to yield to the pull from the heel to find supine and then from supine we let the hand lower us back to prone. 